Welcome back. So last time it, my fleet went on and took on this uh, Imperial Remnant world. We had actually captured it and then brought it into the Warlord's Fold. Um, off camera I did repair my ship uh, up. See, remember it was almost dead and did a few research. Researchers are still going but you know. Destroy nothing it here. A lot missed out on. Full We're gonna speed. go down this way. Oh, that's right. I need to actually get some administration research up. Because <laughs> right now, Crystal is kicking my butt. Yeah. <laughs> research complete. And I really don't want to just sit there buying crystal because that's going to lead to credit problems down the line. And, uh, while off camera, I found out how to t give you that nice big cinematic view. Preparing for hyperspace jump. Look at this. Beautiful. And for all you rebel players, I am a rebel republic alliance type people. I'm sorry, I'm a big uh, Empire fan. I'm a big Sith fan. So yeah, I can uh, go in here and, uh, what's it called? Turn off uh, that uh, as well, just to give you a more dynamic uh, view. You can see almost all the lines have been removed. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Watch Structure the complete. Moving. And of course, we're gonna have to have a warp. Research effect. complete. You know, probably like uh, warp. Yes. Yes, uh, Chaos has now came into the realm, and actually, oh, where is it? I don't want to check your camera. There we go. We're going to get a better color of the skybox. Ooh. Whoa, that's too dark. <laughs> I think we'll go with that one. So space has randomly changed, but it's a lot brighter now, so we can see everything better. Of course, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. This could just be the very same one I changed from. Planet development finished. But yeah. That's what I was talking about, a little warp stone. Whoa, it even looks like the Eye of Terror in 40k universe. That is a bit freaky. Cruiser reporting. We'll be there shortly. Coming about. I'm sorry, the game still has problems Star Destroyer with the standing by. So that's why Base you'll see stuff complete. like that happen. Let's go into the big epic cinematic view. Oh, look at the ships turning. Someone's about to have a bad day. You Preparing can hear the for TIE hyperspace fighters. jump. Structure complete. That big one is not going to happen today. Yeah, they're trying to hide behind the asteroid. What are they after? What in the world? Yes, Commander. Are you, We've got them on scopes. I have no idea why the AI is doing that, but oh well. It's big galactic view. And the beauty 
your space. Everything is in. X, Y, Z, vertical plane. So you can just sit there and fire like that. Oh, this guy's in a bad day. Yep, he's dead. <laughs> Try to beam in that garbage. Guys coming from. Oops. As you can see, the explosions have gotten better from the first video. I don't know what happened. It just suddenly started working better. I didn't even change any of the Your settings, command, it's just suddenly everything worked better. I guess it, there was because it did crash. Oh. The whole reason I built those uh, labs was so I could get this going. Oops. Definitely need this and this. Reporting in. Ah, nice. Now you can actually do damage to those uh, orbital platforms. Yes, Commander. And you'll grab some tacta beams again. Just because they increase damage. Uh, I'm, I don't really like the assault shuttle because you'll capture the ship, which will go against uh, your fleet supplies and even capital ships if you uh, do capture a capital ship. And it kind of uh, actually screws up uh, your, um, your fleet supply and capital ships because you'll get a lot of uh, ineffective ships. Uh, You'll capture a lot of rebel-like ships and stuff, and it's like, oh man, I don't want that. That's a piece of garbage, and you have to go scuttle it. Research complete. So I'd rather just not a get new that colony talent. Has been founded. Ready for orders, sir. On the double. To the next planet. More crystal is needed. More crystal is needed. Something's missing here. Oh. Guess we'll have to go to the market, because some reason the quick finder is <laughs> well, the quick buy is missing. Your command, sir. Oh, you Planet can have some more ships. Finished. I'm getting TIE Fighters because a lot of the neutral races do not have capital ships or large ships, so the TIE Bombers don't do as much Research damage. Complete. They have a lot of frigates and cruisers, which the TIE Fighters actually will do more damage to those. And... Weapons ready. If I wanted buildings, I'd have to go and build this uh, type there, where they would be effective against structures. But there's not enough structures on the AI on the uh, neutral zones for me to go over here and say, okay, yeah, that's worth it. I mean, I guess I can just uh, you know buy it right now since there's no research going on. But really, I Preparing think it's kind of a waste uh, to have uh, a uh, a weaker bomber that is more designed for uh, structures. Planet development. Okay, finished. so it's it's good for cruisers as well. Additional research required. Heavy cruisers. Phase jump complete. Research complete. Yeah, this planet uh, would justify having the uh, bomber squad with the proton bombs. You can 
see there is uh, structures here in there. Research complete. weapons designed for uh, the structures as well so he'll be using those on this and this and this cruiser reporting moving into position and that assault frigate's got a nice chunk of HP yeah That's a beautiful model. We'll sadly watch this beautiful ship go kaboom. Research completed. Oh, someone leveled. Uh, I think it was the Punisher. Research completed. Oh, there's the TIE Bombers. Oh. He's taking fire from something. That was bright. Look at these missiles. They're huge. And the TIE fighter kind of clips the planet. Let's see, here's the bombs. Yeah, I got it just in time as it hit the planet. So yeah, those things are really strong against these type of structures. Yes, Commander. Open fire. Why the hell are you letting this thing just shoot you in the ass? Comlink active on the double. Research complete. Attack that target. Cruiser reporting. Oh, here comes the big torpedoes. Where are you going? Why are you going over here? Destination confirmed. Stop, stop, stop. That's one thing I don't get with the AI. Sometimes it just signs it just wants to go and do its own little thing. Yeah. What are you? A cargo holder? Okay. Moving into position. Open fire. Target sighted. Oh, level him up. I know I probably should have taken the Braun missile strike, but that's going to be more useful later on when I start encountering the rebel faction. Ready for battle. Target sighted. Which I haven't seen the rebels, but then again, I haven't explored much. Ooh, yeah, there we go. That was the death blow. Kind of. Weapons ready. That's one thing I love about the Victory One that I launching kinda, attack. I kind of enjoyed the Victory One and the uh, uh, Imperial Star Destroyer One over their uh, second generation counterparts, because uh, they have that really nice aspect of uh, they're, they're very good at what they do. Uh, this guy is a very good support ship. Uh, 
he uh, takes out the enemy structures really well. Now, this guy is pretty much an uh, anti-enemy ship uh, altogether. He just decimates enemy ship fleets. Not so great at the uh, bombardments as you can see, but he, he really Cruiser decimates reporting. fleets. Launching attack. Gunship reporting. That missile is like the size of these little frigates right here. You see that? Oh. I just kind of love to just sit back and watch uh, my enemies get pummeled. I don't know why. It, it just seems so beautiful to watch your enemies uh, just get decimated like this. Ready for orders, sir. So Attacking you can see target. The um, uh, things did kind of improve. Oh, what are you? Oh, you little tie fighters. Which one of you just magically disappeared? Oh, oh there you are. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Stop doing that! That's really freaky, TIE Fighters. <laughs> You're not supposed to just disappear and reappear. You're not gonna listen to me. I think this is one of the gunboats. Oh, looks like it died. Since it's on a timer, you can only limit lit. It's only for a limited time that you can see that. All three torpedoes. Moving out. Awaiting your command. Engaging the enemy. Oh. At your command. They both stopped attacking. Oh, here's a gunship. Look at this. That is awesome. It's got laser, missile, ion damage. It's pretty much a roundabout to anti-everything. I think the only thing that trumps this is the um, Tide Defender, which is a Warlord's only tr uh, tech. Alright, yeah, Tide Defender. Very expensive unit. Oh, they're all being so patient. <laughs> they get a first-class view of watching a planet get bombarded. Oh. Well, not those guys. They ran out of Your time. Command, sir. I love how everyone just kind of watches the whole planet get blown up until something else gets made. That guy didn't last very long. <laughs> and the nice thing about this mod is uh, that's not like in the Star Wars universe. The Imperial ships can shoot. Is it like that? Uh, like the um, what's it called? The Millennium Falcon getting uh, lightly scraped up by some Tie Fighters? No, the Tie Fighters would uh, fuck up the Millennium Falcon in this uh, mod. It would just tear that thing to pieces. See, this is how the real Star Wars galaxy would have ended if it was going with realistic Awaiting instructions. Well, not realistic, but you know what I mean. If, if it wasn't this, so the plot was, uh, oh, my stormtroopers can't shoot, and uh, the little teddy bears can easily penetrate their uh, combat armor. <laughs> 
It's like, yeah. Terrible design, terrible script, plot, and everything. Don't get me wrong, I love the Star Wars universe, but. Wiped uh, out an enemy colony. A new yeah, colony when has you have a supreme uh, military Ready force for orders, being, sir. getting their ass kicked by a bunch of peasants, it doesn't right away. add up. <laughs> Let us build. Can I get it? Yes, I have it. So since we're going to be needing a lot of crystal. Oh, not that. First things first is we're going to build one of those. Right there. And of course, I need more crystal. Lots more. Planet development finished. I gotta wait for the crystal market to collapse. Preparing for hyperspace jump. Or to even out. Uh, Go here. Oops, not that. And we'll go and build this right here. I guess I can dump the credits onto that. Guess I do need a little more metal. Not much, but some. Phase jump complete. Alrighty. There we go. That should help uh, my economy a lot. Oh, little mm. TIE fighters, and oh crap. <laughs> 